Hey guys, it's Mike from Galaxy S4 Soft Modder, and today I'll be showing you how you can access your notification panel from a locked lock screen. So normally you are able to access your notification panel from your lock screen, but only if you don't have any security enabled. So once you enable security on your lock screen like a pin or a pattern, then it disables your notification panel. So if you want to be able to see your notifications and stuff uh, without having to log into your phone, we can get around that by using an exposed framework module. So of course a prerequisite for this tutorial is to have the exposed framework installed on your Galaxy S4. You can check out my guide on doing so. It's pretty simple to install on a rooted Android phone. And one more requirement is to enable unknown sources in your settings uh, since we'll be installing an app from outside of the Google Play Store. So from your settings uh, under more go to security and under device administration just make sure unknown sources is checked so once you've completed those two requirements head back into the exposed installer and open up the modules repository uh, which is done by just tapping download and here you have a collection of available exposed modules so we're going to look for a uh, module called notification mod. You can use the search bar or just scroll down. It's in alphabetical order. So it's developed by XDA developer VR the one. So once you locate it, just uh, tap download, and once it finishes downloading, the installer should pop up. Uh, but if not, you can always just tap install. So I'll just download it. And this is the installer screen, so just tap install at the bottom. And uh, just tap done. And you'll notice uh, you get a notification that says exposed module is not active yet. So we need to activate it. You can just tap on the notification. Or from the exposed main menu, just tap on modules if you missed a notification. So check the box next to notification mod and reboot your phone for the module to go into effect. Once your phone has booted up, if you already had a secure lock screen, then you can immediately test out your new mod. So yeah, you can see your notification panel now. And uh, also the TouchWiz two finger gesture works. So you can bring down your quick toggles as well. And uh, there are some settings that you can customize. Uh, notification mod is available straight from your app drawer so I was fine with the stock settings I didn't really need to change anything uh, but of course make sure your lock screen notification is uh, checked notification options uh, you can set it to both but if you set it to notification only then you can always do the touch with two finger pull down so it's kind of redundant uh, disable settings button. Uh, it's an experimental feature, so it may or may not work for you. Uh, the AOSP style pull down um, on completely stock Android phones like the Nexus series or ROMs based off of stock Android. Uh, if you pull down on the left side of the status bar, you get your regular notification panel, and if you pull down on the right side, you get your quick settings toggles. But as mentioned before, you do have the TouchWiz uh, two-finger gesture at your leisure. So it's kind of redundant, but you can enable that setting if you want. But yeah, it's a pretty straightforward mod. Uh, if you have any questions or anything, feel free to leave them in the comments below or at the full tutorial. And if you want to see more mods like this one, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.